Hi guys, Yen Chen Jen here, and this is my first video for for my phone. So like my first overhead cam thing. It's not very big. I just have a small table, a ring light, and a little stand to uh, see my drawings. So I'm gonna show you what I have. I have my first Ohuhu collection. This is the 72 set. I wrote it down so I don't forget. It's uh, it looks pretty cool, right? Yeah. So if I open it. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. Oh yes. It has like a nice little barrel. Oh, it's upside down. A little barrel. So I can't really squeeze as much as I can because it's a small, this is a small overhead thing. So hopefully you can read it. I got the, uh, you can read that. Yes. This one is the brush tip. Yeah. And it is a broad tip. Yeah, this is my very first, um, very first alcohol marker set. So I don't know how to do them properly. So this is the very first uh, thing I bought from Amazon. This one cost like, um, if I remember correctly, I think it was $59.99. So yeah, so this is the first thing I got. Also while I was um, buying some more stuff, I also got the, the skin tone set, which is right here. And uh, this is also pretty exciting because I bought this from someone who doesn't need it anymore. So yeah, look at that. Oh, this is so exciting. Has the same thing as the other one. Has the uh, broad tip on this side and the uh, um, brush marker on this side. It has the name. And yeah, that's pretty much it for that. And then I was uh, entering my, uh, my contest. Well, it was a contest giveaway from this little notebook right here this is what i use for my markers so i'm gonna skip ahead and show you what i uh enrolled this is what it was this one took about like three hours to uh to color and then after that after the concert's over i won the pastel set which is epic yes boy and i absolutely love this set i tried out some colors and it looks so pretty look how pretty it is oh i'm so happy has the sh oh yeah i forgot to mention it they both have color swatches you know depending on uh, like what color you see on here sometimes they don't match the cap so you have to color swatch they also come with this little sheet thing this one is for um putting it behind your paper so it doesn't bleed through because these are alcohol markers they can bleed through i'm not a reviewer kind of thing i just want to tell you what i have as my collection so yes and then, I also forgot that I have this, this too big to fit in, but the 120 pack of gel pens. Yes. Why do I have this? I don't know. They add to my collection, I guess. It's too big to showcase, so I'm just going to show you just like this. Oh god. Yeah, see? Too big. So yeah, that's what it looked like. And then after that, I bought, I had a lot of free time and bought this one. This is my, uh, my fine liner set. I also have an extra dual marker that I never finished. See, this is all, I think this is 36 set. Too big to showcase too. And uh, I also got these like dual markers that I'm also collecting at the moment. So that's it for that. I should show you one, one last thing that I have. What I also use for what I draw with is this little case right here. Uh, I got oh <laughs> the needed marker, I mean the eraser got stuck in there. So I use this for for erasing like the sketches. So when I sketch, it becomes like um you know like faded and stuff. My sharpener, and I do have some fine um some fine liners, regular black fine liners in here too. I think I have about six of them right for now. Yes. Okay. Oh, I got. The 0.5. That's uh, yeah. I got the 0.3. I got the 0.1. They're very expensive, so keep in mind that these uh are very expensive. I bought this from the art supply store. I did not realize they were expensive. I bought. I bought like only the three, the three, five, and the one for like, 
I think it was ten dollars. And then I bought the rest of its own, like the brush, the brush one. The brush one is pretty cool. I don't know what to use this for, to be honest. So I guess, uh, I just had it just in case. And I got the zero eight one. I got this. I bought these two separately. That's the black lines I used. I also have a sketch uh, pencil. This is the one I, I found also in the art supply store. I got a gel pen, a white gel pen. It kind of worked, but not that well. Because <laughs> the ink keep like fading away. I also got a sonic eraser. <laughs> Just because. I also have an extra sketch pencil. Because I didn't know. My friend gave this to me. They didn't know I have one, so yeah. And the rest are just uh like erasers like these. I use this eraser for my drawings. You know when I wanna erase those stuff away. I'll put them there for now. And I'll put this here. And this one will come in later. I want this one too. Okay. And that's it for that set. So that's all I have in that. Now I get to show you my art art book. You saw this already, but I just wanted to put that there. I uh, put some color swatches in there already. I might have to zoom in a little bit. There you go. And this is, I uh, also color swatch the fine liner pens. This is the one I have in the set. You can't even see the yellow, the yellow highlighter one. So funny. But yeah, I have that. And then I started it in the skin tone set. I started practicing it on Sonic. This is what he looked like on my first try. Honestly, I what, do not know how to use it. Cause look, you can still see some like, uh, some what do they call it? Like lines, streaky bleed through, whatever you call it on it. And uh, I I didn't realize they also like bleed out of the line. So I kind of line art this first and it came that way. This is this one was the with the old uhuhu I have. I don't know where they are right now, but yes, they, they I it only come in two colors. So. <laughs> That's why I wanted to buy a new one because that happened. And then there's my tails. This one got a lot better. Although the ink splattered out. Yeah, from that. Get the ink splattered out from uh, from that. And then I got a picture of my uh, one of my OCs. And then this is the day when I bought the fine liners. And I got the... Uh, and I tested it on the Equestria girls that, that are easy to draw. And are fun to draw. Also, one of my characters, and there my persona. And when I got the skin set, set finally. I'm gonna put this over there. There we go. And then there's that. He's a villain from a story, don't mind him. You saw this one already. This one was from the Inktober Challenge. I think I might need to buy the gray tone set whenever I have the money too, like I don't have it at the moment. This one, I kind of just made him just to test out the green colors, but I never got to test out the green colors. I made this for Christmas. Uh, oh yeah, this is the, the day when I finally got the pastel set. Oh my god, look look at the, look how pretty that is. That is so pretty. And that's it for that. Um, for now, this is all I have at the moment. If you want me to make some art videos on this, Please uh, leave a like, subscribe, and comment what I should draw. But for now, I don't have anything at the moment. I just want to show you what art supplies I have. So, so yeah, thank you. Bye-bye.